So guys, we've got the bottom reservoir mapped out now. Can you see on the ground? Hi, hello everyone. We're on a new job today. Let's just show you. We are down in Kent. There is naturally occurring rock in this garden. We were able to use some of it but we made the feature quite a bit larger than we initially imagined and the client was able to go and get other types of rock locally and I think, you know, the blend of rocks works pretty well. So guys, we've got the bottom reservoir mapped out now. Can you see on the ground? And we've got a little letter C on the ground here which tells us we're going to have a cascade into that. A letter C here, so we've told ourselves we're going to have a cascade here facing that way towards these chairs. And then, guys, we've got another C here, and that's going to give us our top cascade facing a different way to the middle one. And this will be our upper bio pool, pool filter, nice pool at the top. <laughs> I can't believe you got that film. Really Yeah, we found some bedrock, which you now got to drill out, otherwise we can't make the reservoir one of those things. We've got quite a large reservoir relative to the stream on this one. It makes a lot of mess. Wait, so is my waterproof still in the van or did you bring all of them out? Good luck. Huh? Yeah, not too bad. Round it. Hi guys, arrived on site, it's nice and wet. That is not the water feature, that is just groundwater. So we're gonna have to pump that out before we start. That is uh the classic. Huh? Left wing requirement is the evidence of the door. Hey guys, take two. Huh? Take two, go. Hey guys, it's day five on the site. Just doing our morning prep. We've got to drain out this water here because we don't want that going straight into the feature as soon as we turn it on. Um, preparing a lot of soil for these big rocks around here. You can, where's the, there we go, we're over there. Yeah. We've got some big rocks preparing the soil. Going to put some sand in, make sure it doesn't puncture the liner. That's a yeah. tape, that's a wrap. Hi guys, so we're just uh, doing the final bit of preparation for the resin. Yeah, the audio went badly there, so I'm just back in the studio saying that we're covering all the soil in lots of sand and making everything nice and tight down there so that the reservoir is going to be well protected and secure. So yeah, we're just now buttoning up the reservoir properly. With all this sand, it'll make it absolutely solid. This morning when we came here, it was just a disgusting mud hole. Now it's all nice and clean, shaped, solid. You'll notice our sand is not exactly level. The reason for that is because we've got some large rocks. So for example, a large rock's gonna sit here. So we have to have this part lower than that to lower the rest of the shelf. Lower the rest of the shelf.
We had a huge amount of rain towards the end of the job, so no matter how hard we tried, the site got muddy. Um, we even put down something like 35 bags of sharp sand to help us walk around and alleviate the dark, thick mud. But anyway, the water will clear up in no time, uh, be nice and clear. And once the grass regrows and the plants begin growing, it should look pretty good. Hello. Oh, no. That's a great yeah. shot, yeah. Hello. Oh, no. Now take well, some, get some nice footage, yeah? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Good. No, it won't.